What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy Young Woo back with some more on the block news, man. Before I even get this shit started, make sure y'all hit that like, hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, man. Not later, but right now, make sure y'all check it out my website, ontheblock.com, for that fly merch I got. Like them fly shirts I rock. Um, you feel me? I just dropped Block Music 4, um, matter of fact, in March, and I'll be dropping a new project. June, you feel me? So be prepared for that. I'm gonna get the summer bracken. You feel me? But anyway, the story I'm gonna be reporting on today: uh, Orange County residents traumatized after police killed coyotes that took chunky bite out of a little girl's face at Huntington Beach. Uh, officials have confirmed that one of two coyotes, which were shot and killed by police, was responsible for a violent and unprovoked attack that wounded a two-year-old girl near the Huntington Beach Pier last week. The attack occurred just north of Huntington Beach Pier on the beach itself at about 9.45 p.m. Thursday. The girl who was with her family at the time was taken to a hospital with, with serious head and facial injuries, but survived. So, yeah, man, um, let me watch this shit. Hold on. By officers moments after the toddler was attacked near the Huntington Beach Pier. Baby evidently got like bit and it was just blood all over his face. Authorities say the toddler was with two adults when the coyote attacked around 10 Thursday night. They say the animal held on for nearly 12 seconds before letting that toddler go. Captain Patrick Foy with the state's Department of Fish and Wildlife. There's nothing we could say that would put them at fault for any way whatsoever. And they did not uh, antagonize the coyote. That coyote came out of nowhere and snuck up on this little girl. The toddler suffered serious injuries to her face and was taken to the hospital. Police were able to locate two coyotes. The first they found on the beach after being shot by officers. The second was shot, but not found until Friday afternoon at this mobile home park about a mile away. I mean, let's be real. Animals are going to come out that shouldn't be in the area. I mean, they're looking for food. Coyotes at the beach may sound strange. This video shows four walking through a neighborhood about a month ago, also about a mile from the beach. Police say coyote trappings have ramped up in recent weeks, and locals have spotted them on the sand. Because the wetlands are right here, so it's common sense. I've had two and three of them just walk right by me, not even growl or anything. And a woman that lives in this mobile home park did tell us just a moment ago that uh, in the recent weeks, she has seen three coyotes around this area and she has small dogs, so she was worried about them. As for those coyotes, it is standard practice. If they attack a human to be euthanized, the two coyote carcasses will be tested for rabies and as well as compared to samples that come from the victim's bite. Reporting in Huntington Beach, Leslie Madden, KCAL 9 News. Thank you. Shows a coyote. So yeah, man, the little girl was attacked. Man, I've been, you know, I'm I be smoking and shit, so you know, I be all in the comments. I see motherfuckers when I be watching my my animal videos at the couple kids blunts. Motherfuckers are like, who else baked watching this? But yeah, it teach you a lot about animals and shit. You feel me? How um the what is it, the wild dogs and the hyenas, they like to attack your babies and shit. So I'm pretty sure coyotes fall somewhere within there since they're wild animals. You feel me? They see a two-year-old baby. They hungry. They finna eat. You feel me? But I'm glad the little two-year-old baby is fine. You feel me? Let me know what y'all think in the comments. Hit that like. Hit that subscribe button. Hit the notification bell, man. Not later, but right now. My name is Young Wu. This is On The Block News.